Hello and welcome to episode 4 of my China series. So, in the last one, we primarily focused on research. Ah, uh, now time to convert all the old fighters, I think. Wait, is that what it's allowing me to convert? Oh no. Got... I think that's basically mix. Yeah, so let's see. The technology that I'll be getting is pretty good, I suppose. I suppose I'm nearing the point where technology is going to start advancing. Uh, I don't really know. Oh. Okay, so what's this? In the people's tutelage. Our citizens are now ready for democracy. By Sun Yat-sen's will, we will, shall end the era of single-party rule and hold elections as soon as we can adequately organize them. Ah. So that's what that is. Hmm. I wondered. Ah, yeah. <laughs> So, let's see. oh, so I did the artillery, so we have artillery. Well, three days, that's pretty good. Got night vision, small arms from. 1945, arms, 1945. Okay, so I've already got that. I've got... Ah, so this is what that was. Ah, I see. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so Germany's remilitarizing. They just finished remilitarizing the Rhineland. Okay, so torpedoes, and then 1944 destroyers, I think those would be quite valuable. Okay, so that's three days. Small arms. Hmm. Oh wait, here it is. Modern radio direction finding. Ah, well. Interesting. So yeah. Hmm. So they've remilitarized the Rhineland and Oh. <laughs> the entire world is against them. Right now, it seems. That's nice. Gives me a bit of time. Okay, remilitarizing the straits. Okay, torpedo fine deployment and better bombers. Acoustic mines and better tactical 
jets. Could be yep, tactical jet bombers. Uh, 45, so I imagine it's something. I've basically got the equivalent of. Um, like I'm trying to think of what it was. Uh, something like the Gloucester or something like that. I don't really know too much about aviation enough, or at least rather I don't know enough to make comparisons. But yeah, I'm going to need to build this industry up. Advanced artillery, which goes to field artillery 45. Well, time to convert all that artillery. I should have a large amount of artillery by the end of the game. Okay, so what now? Um, Hmm. Okay, so we haven't got that. Uh, okay, acoustic mines. Electric torpedo. Ah, okay, so I should soon have maximum naval technology. In fact, I might need to actually build a naval industry. Where to build it, though? I think in the south. That would probably be the most optimal place to build it. So, yeah. Hmm. Ah, uh, now to get the carrier stuff. Or the carrier variants. Okay, mm ah, logistics company four. Yep, that's four. Pretty sure it is at least. I'm going to have plenty of equipment to convert. Ah yes, improvements over those units. Future Air Force and Modern Radio and... Okay, well... Okay, nuclear bombs, ah, uh, yep, that should be quite useful. To be fair though, in this game, nuclear bombs are pretty useless. Ah, oh, wait, there. Still haven't gone the production lineup. 49, okay, the type 37. I think I should do quite well. Ah, 
I'll be getting modern military rail network. So that should do me well. Okay, naval. Stick mines. Okay, so. Oh! This one actually is technically an open one, which I could use for almost anything. Which I will lose, use, which I'm gonna use for advanced landing craft. Okay, so. Aerial Monlang and. Improved depth charge motor. Or is that motor? I don't know. But probably mortar. Hmm, yeah. Okay, super heavy armor piercing shell. So I will do this and then. So, and the people's tutelage. Then I'm gonna do. Hmm, what to do after that? National Defense Council. Ah yes, so I think I'll do that too. Then local industry, academia, do that. Then the asylum thing. I think, yeah, what I'm doing now seems pretty good. I mean, it'll probably go faster once this is done, which should be rather nice. Okay, so steel and then aluminium. Okay, so hmm, yeah, so the signal company, which will be four days. Looks like I'm in for a big round of researching. Advanced anti-tank, advanced landing craft, and improved um, stuff here. Yep, that is a lot of things to organize for doing. 40 millimeter. Forty-six, is that? Support forty-six. Ah, well. Semi-modern artillery attack. So, well, before I do that, I'm gonna do 1944 cruiser. Tactical Okay, 
flexible line, flexible line. Yeah, flexible line probably will be best for me, at least. Okay. Pressure mine. This highly advanced mine detects small changes in water pressure caused by a ship moving nearby. Ah, okay, so it's a much more efficient mine. just research more naval tech. Yeah, I think that'll be the best option. Better cruiser armor and heavy ship hull of 1944. Okay, yeah, ground support. That'd be rather nice. Okay, so Italy and Germany have started doing some conquering. Took him a little while to actually do it. <laughs> oh, wow. Yep, that's some serious debuffs. have a lot of, it looks like I'm gonna have plenty of reserves okay so that'll be good seems like the reserves will be I've got three million men 3.3 .3, so yeah I should have a large reserve force should be capable of doing what is possibly needed uh, oh, yeah, God. Yeah. Hmm. I seem to have one million men in the army, but yeah. I have three million men that I can conscript, which is quite useful. I'm rather surprised. I mean, I'm not really that surprised, but eh. If only I could change my voting law. That'd just be great. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. Homing torpedo, and uh, I'm gonna get advanced light batteries. Oh wow, I got the cruiser and uh, the better artillery. Mm. Oh. 
My plan so far seems to be going well. Let's see, so 17 days, well. A raiding fleet. Hmm, well, it might be good. So, Night Vision 2, then all the better type of uh, clothing for specific weather, and just generally better clothing. Hmm. Okay, so, Dispersed Industry. Sweeping. Uh, advanced medium battery. Hmm. hmm let's see. So, uh, I am definitely. Hmm. No. Nope. Seems I am not really winning as much as I thought I was. Hmm. Well, that's somewhat disappointing. Okay. Oh, I'm starting to get uh, better. I'm starting to get a large reserve of fighters. Hmm. Well, I think it is a good time now to start. Doing more construction work, I think. Be very good. Hmm. Uh, so four days, three days, uh, destroy whole cruiser, hmm. Okay, it's got 3,000 convoys, which is pretty good. Ah, so improved rockets. Better recon. And... Well, that's already done. That's done. Better rocket artillery. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. So I've now got my doctrine sorted. Fleet and being. And then... Mass Assault Doctrine. Perfect weapons are overrated. A large number of good enough weapons is the path to victory. So yeah. Hmm. I should have... Hmm, maybe... So that... I know for a fact that the AI in this game, the AI really likes to do the reset tab and so... I have probably till, I probably have uh, another two years really. 
Mm, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Aerial mind sweeping. Okay, so okay, jet tactical bombers. Night vision and jet tactical bombers, so my air force is now done. Modern camouflage pattern, and then the modern camouf camouflage one. Okay, jet tacticals. Hmm. Military high command. Okay. Okay, so that should erase that at least. Oh wow, so that's what that basically implies. Hmm. Hmm, well that'll be uh, interesting. Well, I will soon have all my naval techs finished. See, this Good is going to be... Wait, what? Why is it lagging? Oh, oh boy. Okay, so that should do it. Hmm. Well, I've lost control of that. And I had I didn't realize that that event would happen, so I built up the logistics in the re in the region, which means that I just gave them a lot better supply logistically, which is a bit annoying. Okay, so it looks like I need nuclear reactors. One, two, three, four. In fact, I'll just do four for good measure. And uh, let's see. Yeah. I think I can now 
somewhat afford to design stuff. Destroy hole. Okay, so what I want out of this, let's see. So we're like, wait, the reliability is 20 minus with the max speed being quite good. I am going to add torpedo launches, uh, radar, and sonar, active sonar. Ah, so that's what active sonar does. Uh, dual purpose. Dual purpose. Your purpose, and then these these will be able to handle both air and anything on land, but it'll be mostly used for the sole purpose of you know being able to just scout and stuff. Hmm. So, what about cruisers? Well, for my cruisers, I'm going to have probably a much heavier sign, I think. Well, and sticking with the convention. But they will also have, but instead of having so no, they're going to have fire control, because I want them to be better at surface attack. However, they're going to be maneuverable. Hmm. Actually, no. Mm, no, no. But I will add depth charges instead. Okay, that should be a strong enough type of. Cruiser. Okay, so 48. What do I want? So from a battleship, I want it to be very strong. Plus, I want it to have a heavy hitting, but probably not too great amount of well, firepower. Heavy battery. And another heavy battery. So we've got three. Okay, so that should do it. Well, at least I've got a decent battlecruiser type ship. Hmm. Now, the aircraft carrier is going to be very, very much oriented towards attack, so... I am not going to let... Like... The aircraft carrier will basically be... Strong, but not too strong in some sense. Well, might as well. And it'll, it, it'll definitely have some basic... These will be meant to... These will be designed to be deployed in numbers. Okay. 
Okay, so let's see. Okay, so, huh. Okay, so I should do quite well now. I just need to design a better submarine. Or at least a competent one. Oh, that's just painful. But hey, well, I have cheats, so that's somewhat a saving grace. Semi-modern artillery. Hmm. One. Three. Semi-modern rocket artillery. Hmm. Okay, so let's see. Semi-modern anti-air upgrade. What? <clears throat> oh wait, except it's uh, yeah, it's a high number. Mm, fusing. Okay, so... Yeah, I want visibility to be extremely low.
But yeah, so... Well... I've reached a point where... I'm almost ready. Just need to get my industry rolling. Really quickly. Hmm. Well, I hope you liked the video. Like and subscribe.